Hey everyone, this is Misty with Nerd News Social, and today I'm having a look at a game called Spiritfarer by Thunder Lotus Games. All right, and it's loading up here. Three little dots. And... There we go. Spiritfarer. Start the game. Oh, okay. All right. I got something cute and fuzzy playing with a little ball there. Oh, that looks like us. Great animation. Wow. Ah, finally. I thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that it that would have been, would it not? I'm Sharon. The spirit fairer. Well, that is what I have been until you are rival. I cannot say that I'm sad to leave, but I still have a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you will have to pick up the things where I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are... Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you have brought a friend here with you. What's his name? Oh, do I get the name? Oh, I don't get to name him. He comes with a name. Daffodil. I see. You two will share the burden then. And take it over from me. As I said, in a few minutes I will be gone from this world. And that is why you are here. You will be the new spirit fairer. Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. Does that mean that our character is also dead? The big round bridge over there is the Everdor. The Alpha, where everything starts, and the Omega, where everything ends. This is where all quests get completed, and where the existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this one. Never forget this, Stella. Here, there is something I need to give you. Well, oh, there's this, uh, this big guy here. He kind of reminds me of uh, Nicodemus from the Secret of Nim. Oh, what do I get? Man, this animation's beautiful. Now be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. The symbol of your status here, and the only tool you'll ever need. Wait, what are you... Darn cats. Oh, how highly inappropriate. But, well, that settles it. The Everlight will help you through your travels. It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. I'm still blown away by this animation. It is just beautiful. Hope is a flame, the light that never falters, the beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there is no greater duty than this one. 
The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You will soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments, you are the new spirit fairs after all. Oh, one last thing. Once I am gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you, and it will fade away once I am gone. You might find one not too far from here if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It's time. Here I go. So long, Stella. And good luck. You will need it. Wow. Just gorgeous animation. Okay. Well, let's climb up. Oh, so slippy. There we go. Oh, and the boat's gone. <laughs> Hold B to jump. Hold B to jump higher. Okay. Hold up while jumping to climb through platforms. Okay, right here. A to mm -hmm. interact with the glowing light. Stella, it's really you. Stand up straight and let me get a good look at you. Mm -hmm. You look good. And Daffodil here is here too, I see. Mm -hmm. We'll have to find a lint roller then. Ah, uh, it might not be that obvious after all. Mm -hmm. It's me, Gwen. Good thing you found me. Mm -hmm. But if you're here, it means... Oh, you are the new spirit fairer. Mm -hmm. You are the one replacing Charon. I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disguise, disgusting island for about a week. Living off sardines and cigarettes. Mm -hmm. Funny how I used to be the one getting you out of trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight now. Mm -hmm. Of course. See that boat over there? Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Mm -hmm. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. I'd wager it would work since you're the spirit forever. Okay, meet me on the deck over there. Mm -hmm. I'll explain it all. Oof. Let's see. Nothing interesting going on here. Oh, I guess I gotta go all the way around. <laughs> Come on, cat. Where's my kitty cat? Come along. Look. Interesting. Not a chunk here. Over here. Mm -hmm. Okay, here goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. Mm -hmm. So, 
The way I see it, this boat is yours now. Don't you think? Mm. Good. And as your spirit fairer, welcoming stray spirits is your new job. And once aboard, they will assume their true forms. Mm -hmm. Well, that's my theory anyway. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm -hmm. You need to come here and give me a hug. Okay. All right, let's see. Talk, food, give, food. All right, and a little bit about that. Right. Hug. Much better. Come with me now. Let's take a look at this chaos. Oh no. What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. Beautiful, unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Mm -hmm. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this, or my test allergies will be back. Let me think. Mm -hmm. There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. He's your local shipwright, and his jokes are garbage. But, he's the only one who can fix your boat. Mm -hmm. We should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make the ship move. Mm -hmm. It's really easy, actually. There, let me give you this key I found on the island. It will unlock that cabin in the back. Mm -hmm. You'll find a map projector there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning an escape, remember? Mm -hmm. You know me. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Go open up the cabin, Stella. Mm -hmm. The map projector should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. Mm -hmm. Alright. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. Okay. Oh. Alfred Harbor, okay. And we gotta go there. That's so neat. So neat. I love this animation so much. It's so beautiful. Stella. As I understand, the ship is powered by your Everlight. That's how it cruises the ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. Mm -hmm. You must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. Charon, the Everdoor, the Spearfarers, this place, the boat, me being here. It's a lot. You must be wondering what is going on. Mm -hmm. Truth be told, I don't really know either, but I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you and try to make sense of it all. Mm -hmm. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore the ship. Mm -hmm. You can even give that fishing rod a try. Woo, fishing game! The world is your oyster. Let's see. Ha ha, I can ring the bells. What's down here? Can I go down here? Aw, I'm a kitty. Oh, no, I can't go jumping down. Where's that fishing rod? She said there was a fishing rod. Where is it? Wait. 
Is it a thing that I have already? No? Oh, what's this? Oh, there we go. Okay. I do like me a fishing game. <laughs> oh, I've got a herring. I know we stopped, but I want to want to fish more. Oh, two herring. Okay. Here we are. Albert Shipyard discovered. Okay. Now head down to Albert Shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear this clutter. I'm curious about curious about what it's all made of. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dirt and dust. <laughs> All right. All right. Whoa. Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where's my where are my prices are a customer's best friend? I'm Albert. Been in the business of shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you are the new Spiritfarer? Well, of course you are. Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here after all. Gwen was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. Ha! Ah, let me see what you have here. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the one I built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. See, Charon was unhappy about his gloomy, dank ark. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right. So I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he never abandoned his previous boat. Old habits die hard. But don't worry, we can keep this one. Let's just call it alone. And let me tell you something. You know, we always joke about construction here. Don't worry. We're still working on it. Oh, that's bad. Anyway, with a bit of love, this bird will be resplendent again. First thing you need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day, I'm feeling generous. I'll offer it to you. Free of charge. Mind you, it's a bit bare bones in some terms of functionality. But the subsequent upgrades will come at such a small price, you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. Okay. Upgrade. Now. Um, oh, we can get a mailbox. Guest house, a garden, a field, and a kitchen. Huh. Well. Alright. Got some upgrades. You'll be able to build and edit your boat. Build and edit your buildings on your boat. What a treat. But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and in pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers. All right, that was cool. So I'll go back to my boat. Finally, good. Albert gave it to you for free, and he said he loaned you the ship. Mm -hmm. Ominous. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyways, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above the cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait down here. Alright. Okay. View edit. 
I definitely want to get rid of this stuff. I'm going to salvage. You'll get back 20 maple logs, three empty bottles, two old shoes, and a carpet. Sure. Okay. Now, I guess, wonderful. Oops. Mm, you did a wonderful job, Stella. And the good news is you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary amenity. Mm -hmm. Newly welcomed spirits such as myself will have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. Mm -hmm. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. Okay. So let's build a guest house that we got here. A field, a garden, for all your cooking needs. Oh. There we go. Guest house it is. Okay, so I gotta build within the lines. Okay, nice. So I have a guest house for my little dear friend. Uh oh, sound got out. There we go. Okay. Very nice, she says. Mm. The guest house is very pretty. <laughs> it has your touch. Nice work as usual. Mm. Now at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. Mm. What's going on? Something else is happening. Mm. Ah, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Mm. Very hungry. You know how terrible cook I am. But remember, I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. Mm -hmm. You might have finished a few fishes already. Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fish bone and never survive. Mm -hmm. That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as this sounds, so you should keep on using this blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen on board. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I've seen the plans for it in there, mm -hmm. as well as the necessary resources. Damn. You require bright jelly, mm -hmm. and there's only one way to get some. I... Mm -hmm. Look, I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. Mm -hmm. Dark presence, and even I cower from it. A void that swallows all, light included. It can make many forms, and for me, it was always jellyfish. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. The bright jelly you need for the kitchen, well, only these jellyfish can provide it to you. So there's no other option. Mm -hmm. I'll have to face my fears. But you're here, mm -hmm. and with you I can do it. They will appear as dark patches of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. Go. I'll... Take some time to prepare myself. All right. So, I want to go here and check out this machine. Ooh, oh, there we go. What's this? I have no idea what that is. Oh, some jellyfish. Crates. Resources. Let's go there first. Oh, 
Okay. She's hungry, was recently hugged. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go fishing while we're heading that way. Alrighty, let's see what kind of fishy fish I got. Ooh, another herring. Oh my, okay. Something's going up on the front side I need to attend to. But first, an old shoe. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh. Can I not do anything with this? What's this? Huh. Well, maybe I should. Oh, I can't exit. Okay, well, what do I do with it then? How do I interact? Hmm, I guess I wasn't supposed to come here first. Well, you see. All right. I guess I better change course. No, do a little more fishing. Why not? It's too dark to navigate. Uh oh. So I gotta wait till dawn to navigate. Uh oh. Oh well. What's going on? Stella. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. Mm -hmm. As you can see, the boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your ever light being well light. Or some other technicality. Mm -hmm. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business, or just chill on the deck under the stars. I'd suggest you go to sleep, too, in that cozy room atop your cabin. Mm -hmm. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go, and the ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, speaking of that, you know me. Wake up on time has never been my forte. Mm -hmm. You can ring the big bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Mm -hmm. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, Stella. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. Yeah. Learning all the rules. Alright. So don't ring the bell. And I'm going to fish one more thing out. Why not? More herring. Yay. All right. Let's see. Anything I can do with this? If I want to build something, I don't have the materials for that. Nor that. Nor that. Okay. Hmm. All 
Oh, okay, I see. There we go. Sleep until morning. Yes. I love that giant hat. It is so cute. Press L to toggle the clock and trajectory display on and off. Huh, cool. catch this time. Oh, Harry. Good morning, everybody. Oh, wow. Check out the light rays. Ah, oh, love it. Oh. Don't ask me how, but I've already met Albert. He definitely is a shark. But his interest and all things maritime will be helpful. Mm -hmm. Such as boat upgrades. He sells at an outrageously high price. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. They look like cra classic mythical challenges again. Mm -hmm. Big cliche if you ask me. Mm -hmm. Here we are. Mm -hmm. Damn. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with the bright jelly. Mm -hmm. They should be visible enough. That said, Pop as many as you can. You get glims anyway. I'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out here. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Huh. Okay. What am I supposed to be able to do here? Okay. All right. I'm just like popping. Yeah. Uh oh. This is neat. It's not really combat, but you know. Oh no, I missed the big one. Oh, I gotta get that green one. Ah oh, no, I missed it. Oh, well. Whatever glooms are. the big one. There we go. Fantastic. Okay. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there. Tumbling and diving like a shooting star. And without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. You definitely haven't lost your touch style. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting. Mm -hmm. Slowly digesting myself. Okay. Let's build ourselves a kitchen. All right. Uh, there we go. Okay, I 
think I like that better. No, what? Oh, man. Okay. Right there. Okay. So, right there. And then, huh. What is going on? Okay. Oh, I see. kitchen on top. Okay. I like it like that. Done. Ooh. Lovely kitchen. Mm -hmm. You can now use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any ingredient in the oven, wait for it to be cooked. Mm -hmm. You can even try these corn kernels that have been hanging around my pockets. I can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. to remove that. I don't think I want to fight that many next to cook. Alright. Um. <laughs> Such great animation. So smooth. Alright, I made popcorn. Recipes. Okay. Ah. Alright. Hmm. I could eat anything. Just give me some food. Hmm. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. And then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Wait, I gave her popcorn. Why is she eating cake? Mm -hmm. Don't forget, spirits don't want on sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. Mm -hmm. As for me, I'm sure you'll remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Mm -hmm. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here is something I was supposed to give you. Mm -hmm. I'm not exactly sure how... I'm not sure exactly how it works, but an oval is a symbol of passage. It's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me you knew that already. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's keep improving this craft. As you must have seen in your blueprint, there is a... There is both a field and a garden blueprint, mm -hmm. which means you can grow many different things and turn the ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. It's going to be the easiest to find the resources for around here, and you grow linen in it, which in turn can be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use in it, but that will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Mustine Cove. And there's something on it we need. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you when we get there. Okay. Well. Let's 
set sail to a new cove. There we go. There's that. Is that where we are now? I don't know what that's for. But we'll go there. A little more fishing. And reeling it in. Maybe I should try cooking a fish while I'm at it. A herring. Oh, there's other fish. back in here and let's cook a fish oh wow there's even a little timer there that's neat so either recipes are going to be by time or they're going to cook for a specific amount of time. Ooh, that was neat. I feel like I'm missing out. All right. Look at that. Mustang Island, uh, Mustang Cove discovered. Whoops. <laughs> okay, I don't want to hug the kitty. I want to leave the room. I mean, I do want to hug the kitty. There we go. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Seagulls! Is she going to come with me? Can she come with me? Oh yeah, she can. So pretty. Like, wow. Well, here we go. Mm -hmm. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. Mm -hmm. It's the best way to get wood you actually need. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about Everlight. So, oh, we're making saws. Ah. ah, you actually have to move the joystick back and forth. Well done. Congratulations, for you have become Death, the Destroyer of Worlds. Jokes aside, that's how you do it. You go ahead, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat and build a field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. All right, we got some berries. Got more berries. Oh, wow. I am definitely into this game. This hits all of those cute island building vibes that I enjoy. Oh, oh. oh no, the kitty doesn't like that. <laughs> oh, what's this do? Oh. Whoa. Ah. Okay. Try again. Wow, that was cool. Oh, that's it. 
Oh, the cat's actually up on that little light ball. That's so cute. Okay. Any other things for me to get here? Any secret things for me to get here? No? All right. Oh. I'm really looking forward to playing more of this game. This would be absolutely fun to work on. Oh. Ah, bottles. Neat. Oh, just can't stop. Can't stop. Don't want to stop. <laughs> but I want to thank you for sharing your time with me. Uh, please hit that like button. Comment to let us know that you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to Nerd News Social for more first look game reviews, unboxing videos for cool tech and gadgets, in-person coverage at events throughout the year, and the occasional interview. Ring the bell and be reminded when new content goes live. And I thank you again. We'll see you next video.